Hi guys, welcome to the short video about what you can do if you have new emails on Gmail, I mean Google Mail, and you can't see it in your inbox. This has happened to me since quite some time and it looks like I'm not the only one with this problem. A lot of people are complaining about that. When you know you have an email and you, you just cannot see in, in your email. When you Google for that, let's say I had it with my TV subscriptions, that's called Teleboy. Uh, here I have it. And when I was looking for that, you can search. Yeah, after the, you type it in here, you can easily find everything, but not when you click on the inbox. What's the problem? By the way, I'm going to blurry the whole video, except of course the part which is really important for you. So you will see everything what you need to see, but it makes it a little bit easier for me to uh, save time to prepare this video. So what can you do? You see it with the search string, you don't see it in your inbox. A lot of people are complaining about that. You see this support Google, there are plenty of threats about that. People are complaining since quite some time and there is a lot of feedback a lot of people saying yeah having a sec exact same issue same problem here and so on and so on and there seemed to be no perfect solution for that and i've been trying around that and i have at least found some kind of solution for me so what i have been doing is when you go to the gmail you can on the right top you have these settings here that's this wheel you can click on setting and then configure inbox that's one that's a thing which you can use to activate or deactivate the tabs i've been trying around and actually it didn't do anything for me so what you really have to do is go to uh, click on the wheel again and go to settings and in the settings you have this filter and blocked addresses and I highly recommend to check if you have activated a filter for these emails. So just look through everything what you have here if you can find a filter. And if you have a filter here, I would as a first thing recommend to on the right side click on delete here. So that's the best thing and I would definitely, if you can do that, check if you can see it. For me it didn't work, and but I would recommend you wait till you get the next email and then check again. Maybe it's just working then for the new emails. If it didn't help anything, I would highly recommend then to create a new filter and this is how it works. You go to the email back and you search for the thing which you have been looking for the emails which you uh, didn't get in the e uh, in the inbox yeah you click on one of those and then on the right side you have this filter that's the number three from top filter messages like this and yeah you can even optimize like uh, has different words and so on but usually you should be good with that and then just click on create filter and here's the important thing what you have to do you have to really choose the right labels or check the right boxes here so it's really working so for me the thing which has been really working was this set i have saved it for you and this is never send it to spam, always mark it as important and categorize as primary. I had already, in my case, I had already one filter using for this emails which I didn't see, uh, but unfortunately I didn't save a screenshot of the old settings, but I think there were definitely fewer ones. It was, I think, just categorized as primary and maybe important, but definitely not spam. And yeah, this is like, uh, it's working for me, just with these three settings, everything else did not check, just check these three things and then update your filter and hopefully you it will work for you too. Of course it would be much nicer if we didn't need to set up a filter for that, 
but um, at least we can somehow work around these things but i highly recommend to try without the filter at all maybe for a week or two and check if you can see the emails in your inbox so that's it for now i hope i was able to help you a little bit with that if you have any questions or comments or better solutions or whatever you have please write everything down into the feedback area i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time